Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna hop on and do again a true unboxing of this item from the Coach Online Outlet. But before I get started, I do wanna say thank you to those of you who have subscribed. And if you haven't subscribed already, please consider doing so. I put out a lot of videos about contemporary designer handbags like Coach, Michael Kors, Fossil Ferla, and then also some luxury items like Gucci and Burberry. And for those of you who didn't see my last video about the Mini Vinit Satchel, um, I am selling a bunch of Coach Outlet stuff on my Poshmark. Um, just trying to use my channel as an opportunity to be able to sell some of this stuff as well as get you guys some access to outlet items if you don't have an outlet near you. So this is a bag from the Coach Outlet. Um, I already pulled off some of the um, tape here just to make it easier to unwrap on camera, but otherwise this is going to be kind of a true unboxing of how they wrapped it. Um, so first of all, you can see that it's wrapped really well in um, some foam. So if I pull it open, it's a beautiful Bowery crossbody. So there is some foam protecting the, uh, the inside from the flap, which is really nice. Um, you can see that this side, it feels like suede. I mean, it's probably not suede, but it certainly feels like suede. Um, it's really pretty. It, this bag is a cross grain leather. You can see that it's a turn lock closure has coach stamped there and you just turn it closed to keep it open and closed. Um, the sides are pretty plain. It's the Bowery crossbody. Okay, so now opening it up, oops, um, it has some stuffing, some Oh, and then the chain strap is wrapped really nicely, which is great. More stuffing. Let's see. More stuffing. Um, all right, so I think that is all the stuffing. Oh, and then you have these little um, silica gels to keep the bag dry. All right, so that's all that's in the bag. Um, so the ends of the oops, of the chain strap are also covered. You can see that it's a toggle, so you'll be able to take the chain strap off if you want to. So I'm going to try to pull that wrapping off now. So I'm just going to pull it open. Fantastic. All right. So now we have our chain strap all uncovered. It's a beautiful chain strap, um, as is pretty typical of Coach. It's very similar to the chain strap I have on my other Coach bag. Um, you can see that it's it's interesting. So the way that I guess it sits on the bag, oops. So you have this piece right here on the end, which I guess keeps it in um, in the toggle hole, if that makes sense. And then you can untoggle it using this end. So if you didn't want to have the chain strap on the bag, you just pull it all off and then you can tuck it in here, I guess. Just like that. Um, the back of the bag has a slip pocket, which was also lined or had like some um, foam. It also feels like that suede-like material, which is really, again, really nice. Such a cute little bag. Um, I did buy this bag for resale, but I'm like really considering keeping it and switching it out, trying to sell my large wristlet 25 because I think this is um, a beautiful kind of evening bag um, for when you need to go to a holiday party or a wedding or something. Um, I really like my large wristlet 25, but I think I like this one a little bit more because I'm a sucker for turn locks. I really like the turn lock closure. Um, okay, so let me take the chain strap out and show you how it connects. This is actually really similar to my um, Furla bag. 
you just, it's just a toggle. So you take the toggle, lay it flat, push it through, and then you have your chain strap. And you can see that those, those uh, holders for the toggle say coach, New York. Both sides say that, coach. Um, so the inside of the bag is pretty simple. You have a zip pocket back here. Um, obviously, this is only moving because they're attached by um, a little piece of plastic and I don't have scissors, so I'm not gonna try to rip it off right now, but you have your care instructions. The back slip pocket is pretty small. I would say you could probably fit a card holder in there, but not much else. Um, because this is a pretty small bag. I mean, this is definitely like an evening type of bag. Here's the Creed. Mm, that's going to be hard to see. Um, and that is what the bag looks like. So this is the Coach Bowery crossbody right there. Oh, the one thing it did come with is the hang tag. I don't want to rip this too much. And then you have the hang tag. So this hang tag is a metal hang tag. You can see here that it's covered in plastic. I'm not going to take the plastic off because I want to protect it in case I do want to resell this bag. Um, but yeah, a uh, very beautiful bag. You can kind of see the reflection in the hang tag. Um, I'm really excited. So this bag is really beautiful. Um, I think I'm going to try to resell it on my Poshmark. Like I was saying in the video about my uh, Coach Mini Bennett Satchel, I'm trying to resell bags on Poshmark, um, both to make a small profit on my half, but also to give you guys access to the Coach Outlet if you don't have access to the online outlet or you don't have access to an outlet in your city. Um, so that's where a lot of my bags are going to go. I'll leave a link to my Poshmark down below. Um, I do price things pretty high on the Poshmark because people tend to try to make offers on Poshmark, which means that they'll end up paying a lot lower than the price that's listed for. Um, so what I'm going to do for my subscribers and for people who watch my videos is that um, I'm going to put in the description box below the lowest acceptable price that I'm willing to take for an item, just so you guys know that you can offer that price and I'll accept it um, so that you don't have to play any of the games of like making offers or anything. So yeah, thanks guys for watching. Let me know in the comments below if you have this bag, if you like this bag, or if um, you have any questions. Thanks guys. Bye.